Hey guys, what's up? Today I will show you how to make Swabian sauerkraut rolls. And trust me if I say that they're freaking delicious. So we start with making the dough by mixing two cups of all-purpose flour with one half teaspoon of salt, one egg and about one third cup of water. So I always start mixing everything with a fork. It keeps your hands clean and gives you a better start when you knead the dough by hand. And if you think it's still too dry, then just add some little more water. Make a small ball and put it on the side. The next step is to make our cabbage filling. Heat up some oil in a large pan and add around 9 ounces of diced ham and get all the umami taste by roasting it a bit. And now comes my signature ingredient. I add a whole diced apple and trust me on that one, it's gonna be awesome. Fry everything for a few minutes and add cabbage at last. Then you wanna get most of the water out of the mixture by frying it for at least 5 minutes. And when you got a really nice brown golden color, put everything to the side in a bowl. The next step is to make a flat, thin sheet of our prepared dough. Add the sauerkraut mixture and spread it evenly, but leave about an inch free at the top. That way it's easier to roll it together. Now start rolling. Since the dough is very thin, you gotta act fast. Otherwise it will be very hard to scrape it off the table. Stop at the top and add some water on the plain spot. This will help you to keep everything in shape. Put the cabbage noodle on a cutting board and cut 1 inch thick rolls. And now comes finally the time to fry them in our previously used pan. I didn't clean it because I wanted to keep the flavor on the pan surface. Fry them on the cutting side on top for around 2 minutes. Then flip them over and continue for another 2 minutes. Depending on the size of your pan, add enough beef stock until the rolls are covered up to 1 inch. Let it simmer for another 5 minutes and put the pan in the oven at 390 degrees Fahrenheit for another 6 minutes or until most of the broth has been evaporated. And at last, serve it and enjoy your meal. In German we also say Guten Appetit. I hope you guys enjoyed this recipe and let me know in the comments if you want to see more of Swabian food.